Check this out. This box, this is a limited limited edition box from Hong Kong uh, issued by Pizza Hut. It is a limited dish, four different variations of this box. The artwork on it is gorgeous, but the artwork is not the main event. The main event on the box is that it turns into a movie projector. This is like dinner and a movie. So you get your pizza in the box, you use your phone to scan a QR code, that turns your phone into the film uh, medium, and then that projects through a lens out of the box. Even putting aside its movie projector features, this is a pretty heavy duty pizza box. There appears to be uh, like a grate in the side, like a little exhaust vent. Yeah, it's got two ports on the it's, side it's, for it's sound. Oh, these are for sound? Yes. It's got a thicker liner than most boxes would have. Yeah. The liner is, you know, is the outer paper. So what happens is you would, you would open this thing up uh, your pizza's sitting on the top. If you had no uh, no support in the inside, you have this tiny pizza floating around in a huge box. So they, they give you this to boost up your pie. And then the really important part is, you know, like the little plastic tripod? That yeah, a little up pizza the, tray. Yeah, exactly. That little box protector, in this case, is like this heavy duty thing, which is your lens. What? Yeah, it's so, your lens for the projector and it's your stand for your phone. You pop out this little cardboard circle. several of these boxes. I have one of each design. I'm okay. willing to sacrifice this. Okay, wow. Okay. I'm flattered. It's a big moment, okay? You pop out, I mean, I'm gonna save this. Okay. But you, you pop out the little eye and then take that lens, uh -huh. just grab the, the lens out. Have you done this before? Yeah. On, an, on, on one of the other boxes, so, and you just pop that right in here. Oh my god. I'm gonna use your phone to videotape this, just so we can, everyone can get a good angle on this. You, yeah, do you, you want, want me to? So, all right, here we go. So, great. So this way you adjust your focal length, you adjust the distance from the phone to the lens mm -hmm, to, get, mm -hmm. to get your focus. Okay, okay. Isn't this box going to be completely disgusting with pizza grease when it arrives and not something I'm going to want to stick my fancy iPhone into? Well, that's the thing, is that this platform will be, and uh -huh. the lid probably will be, but not the base. Mm. Is Chinese Pizza Hut like Chinese McDonald's in that you it's going to taste the same as it does in America? Not exactly, and I've never had it, but it's their menu is slightly different. It, it reflects more taste the taste of Hong Kong. So, uh, which is just like, I think McDonald's does that too, where it's like, you go somewhere different and there's like a different feature on the menu, like you get weird black seed buns right. or something. Another thing I'm seeing is these two little, I'll pop these out, why not? These two little wings, Whoa. you can remove them. And I don't know why you'd remove those wings. I don't know if it's to oh, partially keep the this. Sound hole. Well, I, Oh, that's what it is! It keeps the sound Amazing. hole Amazing! Now, but here's the thing about the sound hole, is that your speakers on the phone, it's just on one side, right? Yeah. So why the heck do they have it on both sides? It's a good question. Just Maybe to make it, it reverberates even. in the box? I don't think so. It's a pretty well-engineered box, I gotta say. I'm excited to see it in action. Yeah, it, the thing's amazing. I mean, it's, it's amazing, and then when you get the movie going, it's like, it's okay. For best viewing results, make sure the room is dark. We have, this is Jeff Rubin, Jeff Rubin Studios, obviously, an elaborate lighting grid above us. Um, we might have to find an alternate location that's a little darker to see the movie. All right, so this is it. Yeah, so, okay, we're positioning it and we're like finding the right distance from the lens. What a great movie viewing experience. This Wait, is... it's backwards. <laughs> I kind of assumed the pizza box was gonna be the screen, not the projector. Oh, no, dude, this is, it's the projector. Anything could be a screen. You can use another pizza box as a screen. <laughs> is this the most gimmicky pizza box you're aware of? Yeah, th I mean, there are a couple other boxes that are like augmented reality boxes where you can interact with the box itself through your phone. When you look at the Cassano's box and you tap the screen, it recognizes the box and it plays you a little video of the origin of Cassano's Pizza. I think this is the one that I would probably keep around the longest. Did I show you the video game? It's a normal looking Hell Pizza box until you put your Hell Pizza tablet app right in front of it. A little village rises up in this little town within my app, keeping in mind that the box is still just a normal pizza box. And it is my job to shoot all the zombies. That's pretty cool. That is cool. So this is among the top five most high-tech uses of the box. So what, you explain what's going on here. One pump hold, does one side and the other pump does yeah. the other side. And so, then by we, squeezing, by alternating which one you're doing, you're actually getting this thing to walk. Yeah. So This the, is pretty crazy. Thank you. So it's 10 actuators inside of here um, that are all controlled by these two airlines. 
And the actuator is actually, I, it's, it's fun to do this. Everybody expects there's something inside it.